Welcome everyone to Chill Gaming. This is part four of my Astronaut Let's Play series. So you press tab to open up uh, your research and you've got general ones along the top here. Um, and we had the smelting furnace last time and I've just literally uh, one of, done the research on soil centrifuge. We also want to get the little tractor as well to help it run around. Um, but if I go into the printer here, you can see it needs aluminium. Now, as I recall, it's been a while since um, I played this fully, but that's underground here somewhere. Um, so what we've got to do is find a tube that goes underground, made a, make a load of tethers, and um, start to explore underground to see what we can find under there. So we haven't got many tethers at the moment, so um, they required... I think it's just compound or something, isn't it? Where are they on this? Just trying to find the tethers on it. There they are. So I just need compound. Um, that's over here. So we we'll quickly run over here and grab some of this. Is it here? that run back get our air yeah, back up press Q and build sure that is that need to come how many have I got then? Oh wow I thought we picked up the load. Um okay let's go back and get more but actually what we'll do so we've got T isn't it? That's it. We'll run out, we'll do a few more up here. T T Alright, let's grab some of these. I don't know exactly how many we're going to need, but we're just going to make a small a batch of them. So we can go underground. Right, so we've got four sitting there, so we'll try that for now, press A. Now, I don't believe we can go down here, I think. Let's see. And this is what you've got to do, you've got to literally have it so you can go down here without running all the way down. But sometimes these break through into no man's land. That's creating a, a kind of a step, there you go. So we'll open this up. Now the question is how far down okay. does this go? So I've got a research thing there, let's hand it. Um well let's let's put this up here, get that out of the way. Okay, now we go back down again. Oh, this is what happens if you run down too quick, you slide. So, you just gently press the mouse button. And try and get it so, because this looks like, a, I think there's a drop here. Press E again. Just gently press it to kind of, see if you can get it to go lower. Here, and then run down here. Oh, that's definitely lower there. Um, now, okay, right. What I've done is I've um, I've literally just cut into the side of this shaft, added another tether, and then we're going to work our way down here. 
slowly but surely to see if we can get onto that plateau down there that looks like it's been a bit of a drop here let's see how far down we are what we might need to do is back up here Took a bit further in This way. Let's see if we can dig down more. Because what I'm trying to do is find a bit of, know, for want of another word, bedrock. That's not near enough, so if we put that, say there, grab that one, stick that. See again, and we know that we've got to go down a lot more, so we we'll get rid of that. Oh, oh, oh. Tell you what we've got on here. Yeah. So I think my house, I think we've got to go over here, so let's see. Um, dig into that. to see how far down we're not. Just dig some of it out and um, another two down in a minute. There we go. We get some now. We made our way to ground level. Now those are poisonous things over there. So if we stick to the edge here. Oh. Over this side of the tea down. So you've got a generator of some kind there. You'll be careful down here because what you'll get is loads of other ways down. What we've got here. That's salvage. Marvin. There's not a lot on this one. Oh, okay. So then you just gotta go out and explore, but you've got to remember to make sure you don't have tethers. See again, so that's not near enough. There it is. Okay. Poisonous things there. These are research. Now if you dig these up, sometimes you find one of those um, bigger research things to put in your machine back at the base. These are used to um, better refill it with something to for it to open, and then you get something special below it. Okay. So what I'm really looking for here is not necessarily um, stuff to find. Yeah. No, that's a uh, compound. I'm looking for I can't remember the name of it. Is there a way it has it here? Um, I don't have it. Um, I'm trying to find out if there's a way to get up. You used to have a sheet, it's a cheat sheet that told you what's needed, etc. Like certain things. It's been a long while since I played this, so we've got here power extenders, more debris. So we'll leave that for now. What do we got over there? More poisonous plants. What you're looking for is to, it's like a blue shimmering thing, I think it was. So that's, um, the beauty of the tethers is you, you can't get lost so easy, so you could have a rock walk through here. Just to see what's down here. Pretty 
press Q. Right, we've still got plenty of tethers. Right, looks. Ah, there's something blue in the background there. Is there anything nearer over here? Not that I can see. Right, so let's make our way down to this blue thing, which was there. Open this up a bit. See what's about. It's always wise to sort of expand these and get rid of these sitting up there in the Eventually you'll have a bigger vehicle and if you come down here you'll just get stuck. Now be careful where you are walking because you'll see there'll be another tunnel that'll go down somewhere. Could be down there actually. Ah, yeah there is. There's one that's going down there as you can see. So remember that. The research items, so we'll stick that on the path over there. Where's the stuff there? Well, what's this? So, um, E, get rid of this. T. There, yeah, aluminium materials. This is what we need. The, uh, what does it call it now? Laterite. So, I just grab a whole chunk of this. Find it into aluminium, so I think we've got a little bit more. Okay. There you go, we've got a full load, so now we're going to head back up and we're going to we'll take this one with us actually. It's a bit, a bit slow, but we can do it. get back up there we'll start with research on these you just follow your line back until we've got a better mining uh, vehicle and a paver and stuff I think it was and uh, it then makes getting around down in these places a lot easier as of everything the first times it's slow this needs to be cleared What would be good is to have a cut through somewhere. Uh, let's run up here. This all needs to be sorted out. Going up and up and up back to a little place. If you can't get up or it won't let you, then um, you've got to drop your little uh, research thing. Try and find another way up and grab it before it falls down. See, this is where everything's so uneven. That's the nature of the beast. It gives you a few seconds, pressure seconds, before it starts to roll down, which is handy. So. Yeah, so there's the other one we've got up here already sitting there, so we'll move both of these a little bit nearer. Get them on the research. Before we do that, we want to get this aluminium done. So Q, F turn. I'm going to press the wrong one. Q, F turn that on. Q. And we grab these, put them in. We should get aluminium out. Let them cook. While they're cooking, we'll stick the research on. And let it 
get on with that. Okay, right, so now these are going. Okay, we've got one. Two, stick another one on the burner. There was someone here, right? Two, a, yeah. Maybe you get three space initial canisters on there, you'll have another three set now. Okay, right, so how many do we need for this? We need two compound and one aluminium, so... How many compound have we got in our bag? We haven't, so we've got one now, so let's do one on. Put the other two in there, we're just going. Grab the aluminium from there and put it down here temporarily. Two, grab that one, put that on now. Excellent stuff right now. Let's go over and get some compound from over here. Do put your tips and advice and stuff for things that make life easier so all the viewers can get it in the comments. And if you're enjoying the video and you like the stuff that I do, click the bell so you can get uh, notified on every video I make. And like and subscribe if you want to as well, that all helps. Okay, right, so let's set on that. Okay, on Q, stick another compound in this. Grab one of those and plonk it in there. Press F and tell it to build a soil centrifuge. And then next we've got to build another big platform. Excellent stuff. So these are all built. So that's a medium platform. Right, so we could. Well, I don't think that's going to fit on there. So no, that's going to stay off. So. Platforms that large platform. So we've got to put another large platform when this is finished. What do they need it? Oh, it doesn't let you view other things to print, which is kind of annoying. Okay, right. So we'll let that finish and when that's done we'll see what's needed for the larger platform. Because this will help us, because this you can use all sorts of things to make more materials that you need is really handy. That's almost done. There you go, brilliant stuff. So stick over there for a minute. Press F. Click around these and find the large platform A. So the large platform B looks interesting. So that really needs three resin. Okay, well we've got resin here. So one, two, three. Tell that to build that. that's going, we will get over here, that's the other research, so let's grab that, stick it in there, let's see if we can complete any missions, so let's grab up here, see what's completed and what isn't, what are doing whatever, we had some notifications saying we completed something, there you go, that one. Excellent, okay, so we will need to move this at some stage. Whole thing over here in our production area. So you can put the materials and stuff that we're refining or doing whatever and things like this at some stage. We'll sort that out. So we want to connect this up when it's done. So let's um, position this one there I'd say, so if we say F unpack, move it say to there, grab that, stick it on there, 
red snakes. So I will F on that there. Um, the ERI, how do you rotate this thing around? B do it, oh well, I'm just going to have to leave it there for now. So if we press F on it, um, you can see you can make resin, compound, organic, clay, and it tells you, um, well hopefully it does, that's recycled. So if you say you want resin, what does it need? That's new, this button. Alright, let's try it another way. So normally you just put the soil containers in here. So you used to do it. So these things. So if I grab another resin. I've got one here actually. Yeah. So if we put that in. What does that start to give us? Oh, there you go. So the more soil that you put in. Uh, when that's up to eight, you can make four resins. Or oh, it can make four oh, now, I suppose. There you go. So it's now converting that soil into um, four resins because we're running a bit low on power. It won't do it till the morning. So um, we'll stick that power cell there just for now. And what's that work like? So yeah. Can that go on my bag? So we've got put that there. There you go. So that's going to be handy when we go down um, to these tunnels. Right now, it's almost finished this resin, as you can see. But that's how it works. So it always pays to take um, or make some small containers. So if I grab that resin, stick it in my bag. Make another small container. The compound out there. So that's that done. And then we go to tethers. Let's make another one of those. Excellent. And if you press E and stick your canisters on your gun or your um, what do you call it thing? This thing here. And um, take this one off of this one. Normally, okay, there it is there, let's put it to the side, so press E again, E, and then stick your other one next to it. Now what will happen is, as you're going about out here, say, down in a tunnel, you press E and you just clear a bit of this, and press E, and these will slowly fill up as you can see by this white mark here they slowly fill up when it's full you can then exchange it for um items that you can do in here it's a really handy piece of kit so yeah so that's that, that that's that bit so right what else do we need now we've got to do some more research at some point so smelt furnace soil centrifuge research chamber this, I don't know how important the XO platform is. So press tab. Let's see what other research we've got to do. We really need the buggy somewhere. So that needs... Oh, there you go. We could do the buggy. But we also need... I don't know if that needs the large rover seat. So the buggy is just a, it's not a transport vehicle, it just lets us run around places a lot quicker instead of walking. Um, and it's got its own oxygen. So that needs one aluminium and one compound. So we've just used the compound. So what we'll do is quickly um, run back over here, get a bit more. And I'll show you the buggy. I didn't have it in the other one, I had the small tractor. But you quickly upgrade to the medium size um, tractor then. That's kind of pointless in my book. I could be wrong, but that's how I feel about it. 
Let's grab a chunk of this. Run back. And then what we'll do is um that a bit. F. No, I hope it'll be in here. There it is. So we need two compound and an aluminium. Put the aluminium on and tell it to build it. And once that's built, you'll see. Have we got enough in my. Yes, we have. So we'll stick that back on. It then cut, brings it back out to the end here. Press Q and plonk that back on. I hope you'd build through a floor of those things. If we look at this, that again it will do the same thing. Four. I'll use another one, it'll do eight. So you look what you need. So it'll build two quartz. But that's down um, underground here. Graphite. Ammonium it'll build one. And I think that's used for engines. It's very handy. Right, so if we grab this now and just put it there and press F. Pack. Right, we got to build a seat. So let's have a look here. I saw I didn't find these lying about, so it's not on that one. Um, this is our printer, isn't it? No, where is our other prince? Where is there? So if we press F there. Medium printer. Rover seat. So we need two compound. Okay. Compound. Put that on F. Make one. And that's going to finish up in a moment. And. We'll see. If we move over here to the rover. I'll um, expand this thing out. And oh, hold on. Stick it on there. And you can see it's got two slots. So if we go F to enter, but we've got no power on it, so. If um, where is it now? I thought I stuck a battery on him somewhere. Obviously not. Um, if I find a battery. I don't know. If I've got one on me. No, I haven't. So if um, I know if I put on one of these. Panels there. There you go. Also, I'll stick that one on there. That way, you'll get the best of everything. F to enter it. Now we should have loads of oxygen. So you can see that you're going to just get around everywhere so much quicker. So if you've got loads of tethers on you. This will make exploring the land easy, but you, it's going to be so many pitfalls because you'll end up falling down tunnels or in ravines and stuff. So if you could, once you get the paver, it'd be great because you can make it flat like a road everywhere, and you can just fly around uh, your area and have a look. So if I was to go over here without falling down anything, and it makes skin materials up is, but you can only put what's on your backpack. See, so if I fly around here a bit. If I've missed any of these, which I think there's also in there. There you go, I've got a small wind turbine I'll put back on myself. Nothing else there, and then you go back in. Let's go around and find some others. There, that's another one you use to. Um, Fill it with something and it'll give you a reward or whatever. What I could do here is to just come out here, press F, 
grab that. Obviously, I can't take it back, but I can throw it, put it way out here. So when I come back, I've got some more research material. Fly back over here. That's this little thing goes, doesn't it? Right. Whereas the tractor's a bit slower, but it can carry more and it can tow trailers. And it would be great to take this down in the tunnels to have an explore, but it's just too uneven down there. You constantly um, get stuck everywhere. So if we run over here, let's have a little looky about here. I think we explored this area, didn't we? Yeah, we must have done. So we've got resin down there. Whatever that is. Oh, it's just an old uh, container. Uh, over this. Right, there's more of the research tools there. I'm just trying to find some um, tech that's left laying about. If there is any. I think I've got most of it on the other playthrough. In the media area, anyway. So if we carry on going over here. See what other niceties are around. Right, so we've got stuff here by the look of it. Yeah. Oxygen floors. What to do about those? I've got so many of those things. Okay, so let's go back to that. What's that? It's a light, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so get back into this. Wasn't a lot there. What I might do is take you guys and show you if I can get there. That is, I've got to get through these trees. So I might not be able to do it now. I probably won't. But you can see a build here, a shaft of light. That's um, I think it's like an obelisk kind of thing. But uh. I can't remember what they called them now, but every planet has them, and there's one giant one at the centre of the planet, unless they've changed it. But that's where you um, go when you uh, want to start getting transportation, etc., off of planets and teleporting everywhere. Right, so we came here to explore that one, and it used to have a beacon, I'm sure of it, so you could get your home place back to it. Oh, that always came with one. Here you go, there it is there. So, that's kind of annoying. You can only go so far from your base. Because otherwise you'll get totally lost. And you can see all these ravines now are stopping us travelling here. So this is where we need the paver. So it can lay down um, a path or fill in holes, tubes, etc. So we can get about. Let's head back to base carefully. <laughs> oh, it's great not to have to keep worrying about oxygen every five minutes. So there's our tube for one of them. There we go. I have to get out of that. What do we find on here? So we've got a turbine. We need to make um I'll make a small solar panel of this. Oh that's new, whatever that is. No, so I'm guessing I must have to make it with this. Oh, unless I haven't researched it. Maybe that's the reason. So if we go into small. Definitely blocked. Alright, oh, so. Interesting, okay. Ah. Alright. New. Auto and Optimator. I don't know whether we need that yet. 
stuff like power cells. There we go, that's what we need. Let's get that going. And then go to the small printer. That's it. Should hopefully have it now. No, it doesn't. Maybe that's made in this one then. You see how long it's been since I've played this. Oh, there you go. So, small solar needs copper. Okay, and I thought we had some of that. Ceramic. Ceramic. Could be wrong. No, we haven't got any, so put that compound up there. Put it there. Actually, grab. I'll grab the whole thing, yeah. Alright, so move this. How do you turn the thing around? I can't remember. It used to be, I thought it was mouse wheel. Um, I can't remember how you do it. Right, so grab that, move that there. Connect that up. Even though it's not going to need power, I'll stick these on here. Put that out of the way. And then you used to be able to flip these back around. Um, what is it? ZX, Q, no. AWSD turns it that way. F, no. T. Right, so I'll have to look at the keys. <laughs> right, so we put them there. Um, yeah, so where do we go from now? I suppose it's just carrying on the research and getting the buggies and producing more and more stuff. So if I press, um, what have we got in here? So we've got plenty of tethers, the work light. Um, I'll stick the work light there help and we've got to get some copper to make um, uh, what do you call it for the small solar panel let's we find one so um, we won't need that down in the tunnels which is where we're going to go back to so what I'm going to do is go back down in those tunnels bring some more of that um, that later room stuff or whatever it's called to make this aluminium and have another explore down there and uh yeah i'll see you guys down there okay right we're back down um what it is i'm going the other side now so we went down this way here on the other side just to see what's around here so you have to kill these things off so um there you go they splat like that you get them if you go near them you have to get poisoned so easier just to they drop these things I can't remember what they oh research samples so I'll stick them in your research chamber I suppose and I'll pick them up at some point we'll see what we're going to find out here's a T it's not near enough there's one so there See here, it's, um, it's full of holes, this thing. Okay, so let's just need some. Go through here. <coughs> You're always looking to see what other materials are about. Now there might not be much on this level. We might have to go down another level. There's not a lot around here. 
So um, you can cut through walls, etc. if you really want to. But what I'm going to do is, um, there's not a lot, lot, not a huge amount around here. I'm going to find the nearest tube. So we've got more from here. If we cut through here. Let's just go over here and do it. We know it's through there. So we were running all the way down there to get our aluminium. In theory, we could have just ran through here. See? Right, so let's leave that there. And what we're going to do is we'll go back because we know it's over here somewhere. So let's just see. Create a little curve under here. Is it control or something? There you go, flatness. So if you press control, it flattens yeah, to your level, whatever it is you're standing on. And it uses what's in your canisters to make this fill white stuff. It's always handy to know. So if we grab a whole load of this. So we can see it. There we go. Nice. What we could do is grab a whole load. Hang on, I've got to remember to use my tether. It's easy to forget. Put one down. While you're in here doing this, you're going to be running out of everything. So, there you go. They like hidden in the clay or whatever this is. In. Press Q, other three we can do. Side of this side as well. You just literally mine the wall. See what you come across. Telling you, see the symbol that lights up the light one. It's telling you it's behind this wall somehow. Oh. It looks like we might have more in the ground. Which gets really annoying because it, it creates a problem in itself. Right, so what do we got on us now? A Full canisters and a full load, excellent. Let's go back. What we'll do is we'll put this, all of this stuff, we'll create a little, just a, an area here to put it all in. Let's get rid of that, rid of that. That way when we need it, we know where it all is. Okay, and then E. If I find some more resin, I can make some more of these. So we'll take these off for now. And if we come across, sometimes you do come across it down under the ground. So right, now what we'll do is we'll head up this way. And we'll try and find one of these um, tunnels. And see what's below it. There's one around it somewhere. Keep your eyes out for it. I normally dot it everywhere. As usual, when you want something, it's never there. <laughs> right, so let's have a look. It's around here somewhere. I think it's here. Yeah, it's here. And there. So, right, what we do now is we literally do it as we did before. So it's only a partial. Hit your E. And we'll level it out a little bit, make it easy to get down. And then you're just literally going down. So there you go, it's already exposed it. So this looks like it's going, it just drops straight off. Yeah, so this is a nasty cavern. Um, that goes all the way down by the look of it. Look at the distance. It's a long way down, so this isn't a good one to go in. 
So you got to find another one that's a bit better than that. So we could have a research item there. There. We could go maybe down here and travel back. I don't want to screw that cavern there. Or we could just run up back up here. Let's see, so let's scan that. No I would scan the far here. What we could do is maybe go down here. See what's down this way. Um, yeah, let's go for it. So, T, T, there you go, it's just taking us back to where we were. So, we've got compound sitting up there. Let's run across here. Oh, we've got some more research there. Okay, right, so Yeah, we've got to find a tube that goes down or make one That's the other way you could do it If you can't find anything That's uh, You can use Then you simply make one So I could, in theory um, Find an area like here Out the way And make one Going from here But the trouble is you don't know what's through these Whether this is hollow the other side which is now that that could potentially lead into another area. So go around, but this dam but in underground it's full of holes, these places. It looks like we've had to stumble upon another tube or something here. Yeah. Uh, which we have so that's going down again. So if we make this that's easier to get to. So, oh geez, what's it? Right, press T here somewhere, is it? Yeah. Now, hopefully, this is no, it's just going to be a nightmare to get down. Look at it. That's quite a long way down. Now, the other way we could have done it if we'd have had a um, canister, maybe, is to fill it and level it a bit. That might be the only other way. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. We we'll use one of the canisters, and we'll fill that. So, let's run back over here. Grab one of the canisters. E. Go back down. Let's see if we can get this to work. Oh, I want to run down here too far. So if I press E then control, we've got a gap here that we don't, there you go, so that's how it does, you just literally move it out, so you get it on the level you want, which is there, fill, and as you come down, here yeah, you've got another tether down in a minute, so, and then the plan will be is to it looks like this is full of holes, doesn't it? So if we press control here, all that, and then go down to there. Down. And then we're going to end up mining that. Go below it, so we could. down there temporarily make a bit of a ridge so we don't fall off so so that gives us our way down so we'll hit this if we're running down here and hopefully we won't go over the end of this <laughs> right so press E again we're going to need another tether. There. One 
one there. Right, let's look to see what we've got there. So we've got more of this um what do you call it or over there? More tubes going down everywhere. Make it so it's a bit easier to get up here. Um what to about that hole yet? So uh, we've got over there organic and laterite, which is the aluminium stuff. So the big question would be, there's nothing down there. There's a hole that goes through that. Okay. Oh, I've got to make some more tethers. This is why you bring some of this compound with you. And T. Research item. So we stick that. There. We've got compound sitting up here. T. Compound in the ceiling. That's what, that's quartz, I think that is. Over there. Let's grab another. What's that over there? That better, right? Or is that more compound? Run over us, so this is. Oh, Alright, so here, right. So we could get a bit of that, I suppose. Okay. Ooh, what's that? Oh, some cash, okay. Entirely sure what we're going to use this for. I'm guessing I can't mine this, or can I? It's not letting me get that, unless that's a bug. Maybe that's a bug. <laughs> okay, so Q. Let's quickly get back over here, so I'm going to run out of air. What we'll do is a pile through this, so it'll get easier to get to. There you go, and put another tether down here. I'm not really sure what this will give us, to be honest with you, but we'll give it a go, we'll get a whole load of it. Alright, let's take some of that back over here. Drop it off at the bottom of our little base here for now. Need to pave that. Cool. Right, so let's just drop these down here for a moment. Honestly, don't remember what it makes, but uh, so now we press our E roll. Run it up there. That'll do. Really need to sort something out of this as well. Better. Right, we want to go this way, so. Down here. Shorts going on there, right? So we're gonna 
up that way. Tight. Don't have to make um, that area then, so I do it. So I'm gonna go over this control. So, okay. okay. Right, here we go. So now, if I dig around here, this is um, like a quartz material. Sometimes you get that wool, wool green stuff, whatever it's called. Very rare. Sometimes you can get it on your start planet unless they've changed it. Very minimal amounts as well. A Q, a good chunk of this. Excellent stuff. Come down here a bit. Let's have a load of it. more than enough so now what we're going to do is go back the quartz will obviously make glass I can't remember what the other one makes and the other one makes aluminium let's quickly run back with these what I'll do is I'll get all of this back up to the base and um, I'll see you there okay right um, I brought some of it up so what we'll do is we'll stick some of it in here so we've got that will make glass and we've got some ferrite. I don't know what that makes. Let's put that on here as well. So let's put one of those on. Obviously we've got no power so it's not going to do a lot. And as soon as we get power it goes. Right, so that's going to make glass. So that's what the quartz makes. That the material so let's throw all of this stuff down here while that's making it excellent right now let's, let's let that finish now what's that gonna make zinc interesting okay can't remember how useful that is <laughs> So what I'm going to do is, um, if you press F, it puts it straight in your bag, the stuff you picked up. I didn't realise that. So what I'm going to do here is make a, another canister. It's trying to balance the canisters. I suppose you could have, I mean, you want two on there anyway. I, can't really, I don't know whether they make a um, backpack upgrade in this. So we now can make zinc. Um, and glass so yeah let's see what we can make with more research so what else do we need we need a small wind turbines handy but what we where we want to be is with the medium buggy this is an auto arm medium resource canister so this will all go on the rover fluid and soil canister Canister, okay. Power sensor, that's new. I'm guessing these are all for factories. I've not really played with it that much, but yeah. Splitter. Interesting, that's a new one. Medium generator. So the medium solar panel we need. They cost 2000 and 2500 So those are going to be two important ones we need. And then the RTG, wherever it is, that. Very handy. That was a good lifesaver. Um, but that's an awful lot of bites. So, um, it's a matter of getting the right things that we need. So, medium storage is a handy one. That's unlocked already. And then, storage side of calls That has 24 slots, which is also handy. So, we could start with this small tractor at 1,000, which is probably what we'll have to do. And then... Um, I don't know whether that can have the paver on it. It's too big or item. That costs a lot. We need to make the solid fuel thruster. 
because that's what's needed to blast off on this planet. So we'll have to research that. Let's get that done. And what we'll do next is probably um, get in our buggy and try and group a whole load of research modules and then slowly bring them back here and get these two researchers going. Is that only two I've got? Might have to build another one to try and get as much research going as possible. And then also, um, what do we need? Is it on here, the rocket? Recreational railway engine. Oh, that's interesting. VTOL, what's that? Another new thing on it. Right, okay, so... Where is... I'm guessing it's enlarged then. So we've got shelter, auto extractor. Alright, okay. Shredder. So where are the rockets on here? Ground station. Right, so they've got the small shuttle, which is 1500. It's going to be better. I wish we could go for the large. But it will probably... It's got so limited storage, it's going to probably be better to try and get it for the medium. So if we aim for 4,000 of this, um, and then I think you, the fuel that goes in the rocket, I'm sure it's ammonium. I'm sure it was. So if we press F, this stuff here, I want to make one of those. Can I? Recycle, I don't understand that. So it's saying here we need one soil, which we should have because I just emptied it. There you go. No. So we can make seven of those, unless it needs another. We might need another one of these um, soil thingies, canisters. Maybe it needs two. We'll see when I go back down now. Right, I'm going to leave, wrap it up here, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying this, and you'll continue to watch this and other games that I create content for. Um, if you hit the bell, you'll get notification of every video I make. Uh, hopefully that's what you've all done. If not, then I suggest you do it. And if you like what you see, um, do like and subscribe. It will all help the channel. And uh, I look forward to seeing you next time. Until then... Take it easy guys and I'll see you then.